What's going on, y'all? What is going on? Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for choosing once again to click on my channel. This is Oi Oi. I'm simply here just to do my job and get the messages to the collective. Okay. The first message that I picked up on was uh, some type of war against the feminine energy, okay? So, y'all know I've been going on and on about um, <clears throat> as far as these, um, you know, with the transgender agenda, um, also with the demasculine of men and um, basically the um, the um, humiliation and um, persecution and all that of the feminine energy that's been going on for years, okay? So this goes way back not only to our ancestors, but what they dealt with when it came to having to be a woman um, and, you know, not only having their children taken from them, but their men beat in front of them, and then the men being groomed to um, either beat the women or hate them and made to sleep with their own mothers, which is where the term mother comes from, okay? So I picked up on this energy um, as far as these masculines that's been going hard against these women, and there it's only because they haven't healed and they're um, having problems like accepting that they may be either more feminine or that they really just, um, it's something where they, they don't really like women. They feel more comfortable being around masculine energy. And, um, I would say like a, a, a um, a tarnished, a tarnished feminine energy, which is, you know, a male that is, um, appearing to be a woman. But this is like, if y'all look up Atlanta, when I tell you it has been going down, y'all. Like, we all know, you know what I'm saying, what goes on there, you know. I, my first experience when I went there, you know, we was um, we was just going about our business, getting gas, and stopped at this store. And it was like all these men was out there, but it was like they was looking. And all of a sudden, this one man was like, uh, y'all don't want them. They real women. And I was like, what the hell? What's that mean? So basically, the men there, you know, these men don't even look like that. You know, I'm hearing they want to pump butts, but like it don't even look like that they would be this type of way. But these men are. It's like they more, they're more masculinely dominant when they're, um, you know, over a, a masculine energy or masculine that has, uh, you know, an imbalance, which which is the feminine energy is more domin dominant, dominant, and they. They like that, you know. They don't want a woman that's too strong. They don't want a woman that, you know, either reminds them of their mother and what they went through in their childhood. Like, it goes back to childhood, y'all. It's all about, you know, what we experienced in our environment, you know, what we've, what we dealt with as far as generational curses and what kicks up in our spirit. Because I'm telling you, if you have a, 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 a culture of people, that have been continuously traumatized and, you know, brought up in these environments that are staged and, um, you know, they're very demonic and, um, you know, there is, it's intentional slavery and imprisonment, and it's all mental, you know, and this this is why we have to be balanced and we have to work towards being better. Want better, you know, not just for ourselves, but our children. This is why on this channel, I promote, you know, healing, getting close to the most high, and just, you know, accepting a greater life that is up for all of us. It has the potential to be for all of us once we do the work. You know, we repent, we accept what we've done, what was done to us, you know, and we want to make a change, and that's all it is to it. Everything's internal. You have to start in, inside first, and at this time, you know, you're being called to just have discernment because the false prophets are everywhere. I mean, we know this, you know. But I guess if somebody, people, some people ain't even have no lawyer or the money for a lawyer, okay. I'm also getting like an uprising of some sort. Um, it could be more protests coming up against uh, some form of power. 
Okay, I got I got also got New York again. Something about New York, y'all. I've been picking up uh, since last week, you know. So something could be going up. I'm hearing uprising too. Like something could be going going on in um, New York, and this is simply because of rights and what's been happening with people within the court system. I'm getting to the uh, lawyers, judges. They are all under judgment too. Um, a lot of them have been backing out and backing away of, from cases that they were involved in that they know, um, you know, included fraud or or slander or, you know, things of that nature. If you was paid off, you know, this that's just what it is. You're getting ready to get your, your just do. But let's see what's going on. Only take what resonates, guys. This is going to be a short video, but I want to get... Whatever we need to get out of these cards today. Okay, so some way I've been getting like, holy y'all, y'all understand. Sometimes I'll be like, really, are we still trying? But I'm also okay. So it's something about sacrifices in uh, water magic, um, having to do. You know, water is used to cleanse. We also made up of a lot of water. You know, the whole world, it, 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 we're just water. Let's, let's just call it what it is. There's also a lot of emotions here, what's going on that has been going on in the darkness now being illuminated. Okay, I'm going to get into that there is something um, that has happened or is supposed to happen around the tub. Now, Whitney's, um, Miss Houston spirit has been... If you really connected, like, you know that her spirit has been, it's not at rest, okay? And this is how um, Miss Houston was taken when she was inside of the water at the hotel and they was doing something, like, under her. So, this has to do with either somebody, it's, it's a practitioner here. I'm going to tell you, whatever she's been doing, she's been using water and um, some form of water magic, okay? And this... It's almost like a sacrifice here that's supposed to happen. So keep in mind, like, what can be going on around the tub or around some water. Yep. And on the... ooh -wee. Yep. The devil got a lot of people out in the cold, y'all. I'm going to tell y'all. Whatever was supposed to be completed is not going to be completed because their power is depleting. Like, they don't have no power. And I'm, I'm getting to that some of these people, it's like they... uh, I keep getting that was um, some form of car hopping. Or something, but, but watch who you are getting in and out of a car with, okay? But it's a practitioner here. Let's see what she's been up to. Trying to play God, okay? Okay, somebody has been in the background trying to um, keep somebody from a project. So, I had pulled this up in the last video. Somebody's supposed to be working on something. that's are supposed to um, either help with with humanity or help with the world and this person is um could be a, a moon sign could be a water sign okay but somebody has been causing some form of war it's also something um that was supposed to happen like involving a jail so maybe you're supposed to be locked up for something or locked up longer than you're supposed to um but this was to keep you from some form of of love Either, you know, the love of your child, the love of a business, the love of your spouse or something like that. But somebody was working hard and trying to make sure that you didn't get done what you need to get done for something. But that's not going to work. God sees all. Like... Okay, I'm also picking out her pack light. So somebody could be going on a trip for work. Um, I instantly got that it was a trip. It's a trip for work. Okay, but you need to be packing light. Um, this is also around some type of construction that's getting ready to happen too. So maybe some jobs are getting ready to open up around some type of, uh, I'm carrying demolition or a project of some sort that has to do with construction. You could also be inside of the construction industry. Um, there's been some money that's been, that's, um, that's within this, this current field, okay? And it's going to bring some abundance and it's going to bring some enlightenment. <clears throat> mm, let me 
thank you again. Okay, so I know the things are happening fast. Like I said, we will know it as divine timing, but it's it, it's like always on time. You know, a lot of people have been pretending to be something that they're not. This is also because they've been able to keep up with the costumes that they've been wearing. Okay. I'm also getting to that somebody is <clears throat> either um worried about being in the cold, okay? So somebody could be worried about being in the cold this winter for something that they did. So whoever this practitioner is, she knows that she's going to be out in the cold. I'm also getting that she has either been involved in some type of uh, court case that has to do with a child. Um, that this is getting ready. This is why she's under judgment right now. She was coming against somebody. So somebody could have been trying to um, start some type of chaos or confusion within the courts having to do with a case dealing with a child, okay? But know that justice is coming. It's coming quickly. Yep. Somebody's been worried about... <clears throat> Somebody been worried about how quickly justice is going to come. Don't worry about it. Pray on it and give it to God. Because I'm telling you, once the whatever he does that kicks in, whatever God does, it, the justice is totally different. You don't know how he's getting ready to swing some stuff. You don't know what he's getting ready to do. But know it's going to always be for your greater good. Don't worry about how quick it happens because it's going to happen. The truth just always has to come out. But somebody's been worried about that. You need to worry about keeping yourself balanced and staying focused on your dreams, your goals, and accomplishing things, okay? Because this is a um, this is a feminine energy that has been dealing with some practitioner that's been in the background, that's been interfering. Um, it could have been <clears throat> as far as a love for her. Yeah, but whoever, whoever's been trying to do this, they've been doing it, you know, because they enjoy it. Making sure that somebody somebody's money has been messed up. But you're going to receive your money here. Um, you're going to have justice within this case, too. Whoever it is, they was they was happy being the fool, okay? You was also messing with a man that um, might have been jealous about your relationship with God and how fortunate you are, okay? 